Is this a lab or the next generation's power plant? Researchers are trying to find out more about algae and the power it can create under the microscope. We are born to think as engineers, but this is a biology stream, so <laughs> it takes time to understand how to handle the cells. Algae is particularly good at turning sunlight into food through photosynthesis. The green organism also produces a little bit of electricity in the process. My engineering curiosity popped up. When the electrons are produced in the photosynthesis, why can't it take the electrons out to produce electricity? During photosynthesis, algae absorbs photons and releases electrons. This mechanical engineering lab at Concordia has created a new cartridge which captures those electrons and creates about one volt of electricity. That's enough to power one LED light. And we have different conditions, so we then test them, co compare them to each other and how they perform, how they grow, and then also how, they would, how much power they would generate in the chip. The team is currently looking at scaling the project and putting a lot of those cartridges together. That algae panel might look like a solar panel. It would produce about half the energy, but would be able to operate 24-7. We have been working hard on this for many years to commercialize, to make it bigger production scale, to scale it up, to come to the market and really be useful. Packer Asami says no greenhouse gas emissions are released in this process and algae can actually capture carbon from the atmosphere. So could this be the next renewable source of electricity?